we're going to walk through a quick tutorial on how to set up gated content using sections in Card. So you'll need a Card Pro account and also something that's hosting your gated content. Today we're going to use Outseta. So let's start here in Card. If you've logged in and created your Pro account, you can go ahead and either open up your dashboard or choose a starting point. For this particular tutorial, uh, I came over to Section and used this template here. So as you can see, this template is very nicely already set up for us. So I just did a little bit of adjustment here and this is where we started. So let's go ahead and jump into this template. As you can see, I've gone ahead and made some significant changes to the design and layout. But the most important thing I did was rename this section to be Pro. And the reason I did that is because we want everything in this section to become gated content. In other words, you have to sign up and log in to be able to access it. The only way we can do this in card is by creating uh, its own section and then linking that together with Outseta to be sure that members have to log in and pay or not pay depending on what you want to do to be able to access that information. So as you can see, I've outlaid everything here. I do have a header up top here. You're going to want to have some way for folks to log in as well as sign up. This is all that's on the main screen, but of course this is just a demonstration, so you could certainly have extra information available if you wanted. Once they're in the pro section, I've gone ahead and added this button field, but on the pro section I wanted to be sure that we're not seeing this header. So I've gone ahead and hid that so that this logout option and contact are the only two available options once the members are in. Once you have all that set up, you can go ahead and add in your resources here. So just for this example, I've had created this nice little gallery and added in some buttons to access it. But again, this could be typed content such as written here. These could be links out to other resources. Anything that you want to put in here, um, a video, library, those kinds of things, all just need to be within this pro section. Once you have this styled the way you would like in card, there are a few things we need to do over in Outseta. So let's go over there right now and take a look. Here we are in Outseta and we want to be sure that we have a plan set up. So first we're going to need a plan family and then a plan. So I've gone ahead and created this pro plan under plan families. All you would need to do is click add a plan family and then hit add. So now we have this pro plan and again under billing plans, we added the pro plan. We've gone ahead and given it a rate of $99 per year. But again, you could certainly set that up to be whatever you would like. I've used just the standard pricing. And as you can see, you can add quarterly rates, monthly rates, whatever you'd like to do. So go ahead and set that up accordingly and then hit save. Now we have our plan and our plan family, but we need a way to connect everything to this uh, section we just created in card. For that, we'll need to go to auth and grab a few different pieces of information. So first we're under sign up and login. For our login settings, I've chosen individual mode and put the correct URL post login after they've signed up via email. This uh, is that pro which will take them to what appears to be a new page but it's actually just a section. So we've put that login there and I've gone ahead and indicated I just need the name and email for the sign up form field and that's all the information that we're going to collect. We go to embeds. This will allow us to connect everything together. So we want to be sure that we're installing this header script first. So we're going to go ahead and hit copy, gather all that information, and then come back over to card. In card, we can put this information in using an embed. So if you're not familiar with that, you just use the plus sign and grab, grab embed. Again, this is only available in pro and up, so be sure you're choosing the appropriate plan when you sign up for card. 
So once you have that embed code, you're going to want to leave the type as code. You can give it any label you like. For my purposes, I've used it outside of head code here. But this is important to pay attention. The style we want as hidden, and this needs to say head. From there, you just go ahead and paste the code right in here. And that's all you need here. Go ahead and hit done. Now we need to get a couple more things from Outseta to be sure that all of this is linked together. Now that we've installed our head script from Outseta, we need to uh, add in this sign up link. This will allow a little pop up so that if people want to sign up right on the site, they can do that. So we're just going to go ahead and hit copy here and come back over to card. Here at card, we'll scroll up to the top and come to our button that says sign up today. Here's where we want to add that code. Go ahead and click on sign up today. And then the URL we're going to paste in is that URL we just copied. So just go ahead and copy all that and paste it in and hit done. Now we'll want to take care of this login button as well for returning users. So let's go get that. As you can see, here's the login link. So we're just going to go ahead and copy that now. And just like we did before, we're going to use that as our URL. Back in card, be sure that you're on your login button and scroll down to the URL and paste that information there and hit done. Now we need to do our log out button. So let's go ahead and do that too. Here in Outseta, we're just going to, again, hit the copy button and grab log out link. We're back in card for our little pro section, allowing members to log out. Click on the log out button and we just need to put that URL there and go ahead and hit done. Now we have everything connected together so that when members log in, they'll only have access to this pro account. The last thing we need to do in Outseta is make sure that we have our protect protected content set up as well. So if we come to Auth and come all the way down to protected content, you'll see we have content groups. Here we can add protected content and call it whatever you would like. I've gone ahead and set up Pro already, so let's take a look at that. So if we click on our Pro plan, you can see that you can specify the URL, so we'll need to update this now. Specify the folders and pages. For us, the page is represented by a section, so we're just going to go ahead and hide everything in that from non-members. This will ensure that that gated content isn't visible to anyone who hasn't logged in and or paid. If we had more than one protected content section, we would go ahead and just add another URL and you could call this uh, free if you wanted free content as well and so on and so forth. So you can see you can keep adding those sections. They'll represent additional pages and just be sure that you're adding them to your protected content section here in Outseta. Once you have that set up, you're going to want to go ahead and add on the plans that should have access to the group. So for us, that's the pro plan. So all I did was hit pro. Now, because it's already there, you can see test is the only other one that's available. So that's why it's important to set up your plans and plan families first so that when you get to protected content, everything is access accessible for you. You can set up an access denied URL. You could create another section that has a sign up page and put that here. You could just simply call it sign up and put the redirect in here. I've left it blank so that it'll just go to the home page. That way people can click that sign up button there. Once you have everything set up, go ahead and hit save. And now you're all ready to go. As you can see, the cache configuration uh, may take a little bit, so you'll need to open a new window in order to see these changes take place. That is how you set up gated content using sections with Card and Outseta. Hope you found this helpful.